my relationship with the director and many sound designers is, yes, he's involved in how the he wants the audience to feel. And quite honestly, he's less interested in, in what the quality of the sound achieves that than might be a volume level or a, a, a softness or an EQ. But it's fascinating to watch a director choose, make sonic choices on movies to get his emotional idea across. And um, I'm fascinated as a sound designer because that oftentimes doesn't mean it's a very interesting sound or cool sound. It's just, it's just the way that he wants it to sound. The sound designer has a lot of control over what elements he or she uses to make the audience feel a certain way. But ultimately, that will be determined by the director in the mix. We'll all sort of help him get that. And again, I, I reiterate, I'm always fascinated by what directors think is the right sound for a certain scene. And uh, oftentimes it's, it's, it's out of our realm of understanding as sound people because we're focused on the sound and he's or she is thinking way above that. They're not seeing it myopically as we are sometimes. They really see sound as this very important part to help shape or help get across that emotional idea that they're trying to tell the audience.